Hello everyone, this is Dr. Manal Abdul. I'm very glad to be with you today in a new video. Uh, this video is essential for beginners. Uh, I'm gonna uh, show you today how to uh, use the coordinate system to change the origin uh, of uh, the UCS icon, uh, how to uh, draw using uh, relative uh, coordinate, uh, how to uh, modify the units, and how to use uh, the basic uh, drawing tools to complete this uh, drawing. Uh, jump to AutoCAD and get started. To complete this drawing, let's start by uh, setting the uh, units. Down here on the taskbar, you will find the units. You click on it or you put it architectural to have it in inches. Or if you don't find it, you can check the customization and uh, check the units and you can um, make the units on another way to find the units uh, from the application menu drawing utilities unit here's the unit type you can make that to architectural leave the uh, insertion scale to inches or simply type you in enter you will get the same dialog box now let's have the taskbar. Make sure that you do have uh, object snap and uh, let's make endpoint active. Uh, later on, if we need to add any of these uh, object snap, we can uh, do it. Uh, if you would like to uh, watch my video about object snap, please uh, review my previous videos. Uh, object snap tracking, the F11, make it uh, on. Polar tracking, also we need the polar tracking to be set to multiple of 90 degrees. In this case, we will get dash line or reference lines to give us um, a way to know that we are drawing horizontal or vertical lines. Uh, lastly, we have the dynamic input and the dynamic input now is on. Uh, that means we have some instructions on the screen. Any of these, if it's not available, just make sure it is uh, available here and uh, check next to that. Uh, now let's get uh, started with the drawing. We will start the line command either way from the home tab, the draw panel, click on line or simply L enter. The first point, it doesn't matter. I'm going to start uh, drawing this vertical line. So I'm going to start from any point. Click on the screen. Uh, we will go down. The distance here all is 1.25. We have here uh, 0.25 and uh, 0.50. So what's left here is 0.50. So 0.5, enter. Let's give direction to the right and 0.75, enter. So direction, then distance. Go down, follow the dashed line, 0.5, enter. Uh, go to the left. Uh, here you can type it or simply without a clicking go to the upper corner and drag it down. So that will help you with the drawing faster. Now we need to go 0.25 and the distance here is a 3. So let's go to the right. 3, enter. Uh, go up. Uh, the distance up is uh, 1.5. So make sure you follow the reference line. 1.5, type the distance, enter. Now we need to uh, draw this diagonal line. Uh, draw this diagonal line. We don't have um, the angle. If we do have the angle, we can set it down. Um, if we like to do some calculation, figure it out, that's fine. I will show you how to draw it using a relative coordinate at. Now I will type at, at the beginning I'll type at, then I will uh, put the x and y. The x here from this point we need to go to the left, negative 0.75 because we're going to the left. So going to the left that means negative. Um, and this point is negative 0.75. We need to go up. The distance here is 0.5 because we need to subtract 2 minus 1.5. So we will type the x, negative 0.75, comma. Now we put the y, which is uh, 0.5. Enter. We draw this line. Now we follow the horizontal line, 1, enter. Then simply close it. Uh, we can put c, enter, or just uh, click on the 
line. So C enter to close. Uh, we finish this drawing. Now, uh, what's left here is the circle. Uh, what we know about the circle is the diameter 1. So, if the diameter 1, the radius is half, be careful when you draw it using the circle center, um, uh, radius, or diameter. So, if you put radius, that means it's half. If we put diameter, that means it's 1. Now, the center point is 1 to the left, 1 up from this point. Now, I can draw some construction line from here, like I can draw a line, then put the center, or I will move uh, the, the origin of uh, the user coordinate system, X and Y. So, let's move that, which is, I believe, it's easier. So, click on uh, the origin move and align i'm gonna set it up here doing so we'll move the origin of this corner to be zero zero that means the x is zero and the y is zero now i repeat the center diameter so let's draw now the uh, circle using center diameter uh, if the diameter uh, one i will choose center diameter uh, one or center radius but in this case is 0.5 now, specify center point. I will type negative 1 because the origin is here. I will go to the left. That make it negative. And I will go up 1. So, I will type negative 1, comma, 1. Enter. And here you go. We find the center of the circle. The diameter is 1. I'll type 1 and hit the enter button. So we finish uh, uh, this drawing. Uh, remember, in AutoCAD, we can use several ways. You can draw some construction lines, but we need to draw accurate drawing with uh, efficiency. So we don't need to spend a lot of time. Let's find more easy or easier ways to finish the work and uh, changing the coordinate system uh, the way that I prefer it in most cases. If you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you didn't already to get notified when I publish a new video. Thank you so much. Looking forward to working with you again in a new video. Dr. Abdul.